All right, Puerto Rico. Now everyone's heard of this territory. There's so many things to mention about Puerto Rico, but we'll talk about more about later. But first, the flag. It's really easy. Let's start with the tracing. All right, next we want to draw a bunch of lines. Um, let me trace them again. Alright, next you want to, I kind of forgot you have to draw a big star like that. Alright, the only colors you need are light blue and red. Let's start off with the red. It's red here, here, and here. Let's get to drawing it. All right, there's the red. Now for the light blue, it's light blue on this triangle and the star is white. Let's get to drawing it. All right, there's the flag of Puerto Rico. The capital is San Juan. Now this is our largest and most populated territory of all, of all the five territories with around 3.3 million people. It is located in the Caribbean. Alright, the governor is Pedro Pulisi. He has two political affiliations. One called PNP, which stands for a new progressive party, and his other affiliation is a Democrat. So yeah. And, so many things to mention about Puerto Rico. It is it is a unincorporated, organized commonwealth territory. The people here are known as Boricuas, along with the Cubans and Dominicans. They make up the trifecta of Latin Caribbeans. And you have all kinds of Puerto Ricans. You got the white Puerto Ricans, the black Puerto Ricans, and the mestizo Puerto Ricans. It was once the mo and once the most viewed video on YouTube, Despacito, was filmed in Puerto Rico with over seven billion views. And now it's Baby Shark, over nine billion views. That's crazy. And Puerto Rico, in its own logical sense, its own country, but it still falls under U.S. territory status. And in 2017, the whole island was devastated by Hurricane Maria, and more than 160,000 Puerto Ricans moved to the U.S. It left the whole island without power. And before that, um, Hurricane Irma also destroyed the island. Yeah, it was really bad. And there's a few noble people from here, including the one behind Despacito, Luis Fonzi. Tons of baseball players like these are from here. But the most famous one being Roberto Clemente. He's one of the most he's probably the most famous baseball player from Puerto Rico. PNP and Democrat. All right, it was incorporated on March 2nd, 1917. Prior to becoming a territory, they were under Spanish rule. Puerto Rico was actually the oldest colony to ever exist in history, being ruled by Spain for over 400 years. And yeah. And prior to that, like, Taino tribes came in and... It was discovered by Christopher Columbus, like Christopher Columbus arrived here in the 1400s and the 1500s as well. So March 2nd, 1917. And after the Spanish-American War, we took this from Spain. Yeah. All right, the national bird is the Puerto Rico Spindulus. The national flower is called the Flor de Magas in Spanish. And the National animal is the Puerto Rican coqui, which is a type of frog. And they also speak Spanish. That is another national language in Puerto Rico. Spanish and English. Those are the two main languages in Puerto Rico. Uh, there's a lot of people in Puerto Rico. There's actually more Puerto Ricans in the U.S. than there are in Puerto Rico. There's a, uh, there's a lot of people in Puerto Rico near where I live. There's a lot of Puerto Ricans that go to my school. And yeah. Anyway, now for the history of Puerto Rico. And that's about it. Stay tuned. 
The last territory, the U.S. Virgin Islands, are next.